This was our second consecutive spring of Max grunting, swearing, and throwing a lot of pitches in his first outing. Um, I, I would assume you're not surprised by any of that. And kind of what did you just think of what you saw? Uh, I thought Max looked really good. Like I feel like Max always does. I mean, um, you know, I'm, that's him. That's his intensity that he likes to have. And, um, you know, he's, he works hard no matter what aspect it is on or off the field. When he, you know, is going on five, six, seven minutes beyond all the other guys and they're just kind of standing and admiring and watching it, do you think that can kind of rub off the work ethic that he has? Uh, of course. I mean, I don't, I, don't, I don't see why not. I mean, you know, watching a guy like that, um, I think if you ask Max, um, you know, I think he's, I even heard him talk about watching guys when he was coming up, uh, working hard and, uh, you know, taking that into his, you know, his game and, and learning about that and learning about himself and what he needs to do to be his best self too. I know he had you calling pitches there to invisible batters, but like, is it a cool, or is it a chance for you also to I mean, work on things? And yeah, I mean, for, you know, I mean, for myself personally, uh, you know, catching bullpens is, to me, that's invaluable because it's, you're, you're starting to work on, uh, you know, receiving, framing, things like that. I mean, you can go in the cage and, and do stuff, you know, at whatever, whatever speed you want to call it, but it's not, it's not close to game like, and that's the closest to game like you're going to get. Um, so, you know, doing that and, and working on what you've been working on all off season, I think is important and taking advantage of that time as well. How would you equate kind of the liveliness and shape of his pitches today to what they are in a regular season? Uh, I think that's a secret of his. I think he's going to have to, you know, he's going to show his repertoire as the, as the season goes. But um, I mean, I think he looks as sharp as ever and uh, it's going to be an exciting year, um, you know, not just for him, but for the whole team. For you, sir. Coming up, coming into the spring after a, you know, last year, kind of getting your most extended playing time. Um, just to, I don't know, how, how are you feeling, and what uh, is kind of your approach or mindset or coming into your after coming up last year? Uh, well, I feel great. Um, you know, I had a great off season training with my brother and you know a bunch of other guys, and uh, getting down here and you know being with the rest of the boys is a lot of fun. Um, you know, just constantly trying to build off of what I did last year. I feel like it's like that every year, just never, never feeling that content feeling, never being content with what you're doing, and um, just you know constantly trying to find little areas that you can improve upon, whether it's on the field, off the field, stretching routines, you know, video, whatever it might be, just trying to find that edge. The little areas that you focused on on the field for this year, in the offseason. Yeah, you know, I mean, I worked a lot on um, some receiving stuff uh, when it comes to you know framing and framing pitches. Um, I have a you know good routine that I like to do um, during the off season um, when it comes to catching and things like that. So you know get get your blocks in, get your footwork in, and things like that. Um, and then you know the hitting is is just part of it. I feel like, but um, you know just trying to be as a, make myself as efficient as possible when it comes to any kind of motion. I think is what my goal is. Is there anything that like you know now from the experience that you had last year being in the big leagues for a good chunk of time? Anything you know now that you maybe didn't know then that. Yeah. Where you are, you know, think about where you've progressed and where you are now a year later. Um, you know, I mean, there's a lot that happens. I feel like behind the scenes, uh, you know, in in anybody's progression, um, you know. But myself personally, I feel like, you know, just just rem remembering who I am and just being myself, as cheesy as it sounds. I mean, I think that's that's the most important thing. I mean, just knowing what my role is and you know, showing up to the field every day, just bringing your A game and. Whether if it's in the you know locker room, whether or wherever it might be, I think that's the most important.